Ghana confirms its first case of the deadly Marburg virus, leaving two people dead. The World Health Organization, who announced in a statement on Sunday that Ghana has confirmed its first two cases of the extremely contagious Marburg virus sickness. The declaration follows the results of two unconnected individuals from Ghana's southern Ashanti area who tested positive for the virus and later passed away. The patients reported diarrhea, fever, nausea, and vomiting, according to the WHO, who also noted that more than 90 contacts are being kept under under observation. According to the WHO, Marburg is a highly contagious viral hemorrhagic fever with a death rate of up to 88% that belongs to the same virus family as the more well-known Ebola virus disease. It said that the illness began suddenly, with a high fever, a very bad headache, and malaise. According to the WHO, the virus is carried from fruit bats to humans and can then be transferred from one person to another by coming into touch with their bodily fluids, contaminated surfaces, or items. The International Health Organization announced that containment measures were being implemented and that additional resources would be used to address the outbreak in Ghana who also cautioned that Marburg can easily get out of hand without immediate and effective response. For the Marburg virus, there are no licensed vaccinations or antiviral medications. The WHO stated that treatments such as oral or intravenous rehydration and management of particular symptoms can increase a patient's chances of survival. The Marburg virus is not currently the target of any licensed vaccines or antiviral medications. However, Treatment that includes oral or intravenous rehydration and treatment of particular symptoms might increase the patient's chances of life, according to the WHO. After Guinea discovered the virus last year, Ghana is only seeing its second epidemic in West Africa. The virus also claimed the life of the patient in the epidemic in Guinea. Health authorities in Guinea confirmed that there were no additional instances. Previous outbreaks have been documented in South Africa, Kenya, Angola, Uganda, and the Democratic Republic of the Congo, among other countries in Africa. With more than 200 fatalities, the Angola epidemic in 2005 